What's up, everybody? How's it going? We're playing Angel Arena Reborn, which got updated like yesterday. What the hell? Look at this. It's actually been updated a lot recently, right? December 2020. Um, yeah, I, I don't know why. I, let me actually check what the most recent update before that was. Um, oh, no, it doesn't even go back that far. It's just actually been getting updated. Uh, so that's kind of exciting, and I'm really looking forward to it. And I thought this seemed like a good, good thing to play, right? This is this just sounds like a good, good opportunity for us to do something that's a bit of fun and uh, a bit of chill. Uh, I know that's not really how English works, but I don't really care because I just need to, I just need to like relax a little, you know, and do something that's a bit relaxing. Anyway, wait, they changed the map. Holy hell, what is this? The map is different. <laughs> okay. Wait, are these like... What do you... Are you just a tower? What do you do? You do nothing. Okay, great. I guess there we go. Uh, we're playing Omni Knight. Why are we playing Omni Knight? Well, Omni Knight has uh, a fun new Aghanim shot, which I felt might be a good good thing for this mode. Right? Like, doesn't it seem kind of powerful? Oh my god, look at how much they changed the map. Oh my... I don't. Did I want to fight you, I guess? No, probably not. You seem kind of nasty, right? All right, we need this talisman thing. Um, how much is it? Where do I buy it? There we go. Talisman of Mastery. The granting experience based on damage. Okay. That seems good. I also want a fluffy hat. I honestly just want a fluffy hat like this in real life. Can somebody send me a fluffy hat? <laughs> nice. <laughs> I mean, look at this thing. Does this not look like the... Wait, where is it? Look, look, isn't this like the comfiest thing you've ever seen? I want this fluffy hat. And no, I don't... Well, I guess that's kind of fluffy. This is not really what I had in mind. All right. Okay. Th this will do. Hello. I have a fluffy hat. Um, oh, no. Okay. I'm, I'm running away from this guy. Hello. Your, your mother. Ow! Get him! Nice. Alright, I have a fluffy hat. Which is nice. Next up. Well, I don't know actually. What is next up? What is this? This is the vampire claw. This seems not too bad. Oh, we're dead. <laughs> well, that seems kind of bad. <laughs> I just want my little, little item here. Like, hook me up, dude. Okay, <clears throat> so let me get this. Are you going to root for design completely new ex mechanics for expansions or just cool cards working for an existing one? Uh, also, anything you can t tell us about it already? Uh, you mean okay? So we were just talking about the Chroma expansion that I, I was just kind of discussing that a little bit. Um, I, I don't want to spend too much time on this because I think it's not going to be super interesting for the people that don't care about it. Um, but uh, basically, the first expansion will mostly be core mechanics, but explored in uh, ways that I'm hoping will be interesting. And honestly, uh, a lot of it is also just, you gotta keep in mind that um, as you're designing a game, your understanding of it grows and grows and you become better and better at making that game, right? So I feel a lot more capable of making Chroma cards now than I did at any point in the past. Um, and so... That's kind of like why I feel uh, I want the first expansion to be kind of mostly just the basics because I want it to feel really good based on the basics. Um, and then uh, we'll go from there afterwards. I'm always open. I think having like kind of unique mechanics per expansions is actually like a totally fine thing. And I think it sounds really cool. I just think for the first expansion, I want to focus on on the things that I've learned first and explore those. And I will not tell you anything about it. Not a single thing. Not a word. Anything I tell you will be pretty major spoilers. And I don't want that. Oh my god, these guys go hard. Why does this guy go so hard? Okay, I gotta go. Do you have healing? No, you don't. What is this? Oh, this is the dual arena. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I was like, did I find something like crazy? You know, like the old Walker free maps, they might have like stuff like this. Where um, there's like this gate that you need to open and inside of it is a it's a creepy boss or something like that I am needed. so anyway 
What are you? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> so, no. <laughs> <laughs> that guy has 15,000 HP. <laughs> uh, okay. Alright, so I'm not entirely sure which creeps we're supposed to be farming. No, I didn't hit it. I didn't hit it. This fluffy heart is too small for my head. It's also not as fluffy as I had one. I want, I want this kind of fluffy heart. This heart seems amazing. That's all I need. It's a fluffy hat like that. Alright. I'm just gonna go ahead and hit these guys a lot. I think getting this dimensional predictor is not a terrible idea. <clears throat> okay. Alright, illusion rune. <laughs> Seriously, I'd watch the video and make you record it. Chad is trying to convince me to like reduce my stress to get other people to record videos for me. Um, which, honestly speaking, I think that would just stress me out even more. Look at that, they even made the arena kind of nice. Like it's got like high grounds and shit now. Alright, that's good. That's a good hit. We like, we like a hit like that. Alright. Okay, thank you. No, 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 no. I am... Um, so I'm I'm pretty happy with how things are going because, like, I'm, I'm keeping a lot of them busy. Which is good. I don't know if we are, like, overall winning. Oh, I couldn't get my heal out in time. Damn it. This fluffy hat is giving me a headache. It's too small for my big head. <laughs> No, I, 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 that will not happen. It will be way more stressful for me if somebody else records. And then I need, because then I need to check that first. Like, I don't even know what's going to be in it. Oh, yeah. Oh. Dazzle? Come on, Dazzle. You can do it. This Dazzle is actually really strong. What the fuck? How is this Dazzle actually? Why are you guys not doing any damage to this guy? Oh, this poor man's shield. Let's go, Dazzle. Alright. That was a pretty intense duel, man. Let's go. Alright. This actually is like sick. This is like a really nice patch. I think everything I've seen so far in this patch, I'm like, hell yeah, dude. This is awesome. I like... I like how they, like, drastically expanded how many creeps there are on the map. They really, like, it really feels like there's a lot more places you can go now. And, like, anywhere I can go, I can just quickly go and pick up a creep to farm. I recognize these designs or these design ideas because I had a lot of the same ones for OAA. Which I know that sounds like I'm just trying to be a wiener now and somehow claiming that I had the idea first. But that's not really my point. It's just, you know... I think this is right. This is the right way to go. This is very nice. I like it a lot. Okay, uh, anything here? Haste rune. Huh, I wonder if we can do something with that. I need to figure out what items there are in the game. Um, this Witchblade is probably not so good. Doesn't upgrade Amber's knife. What's this do? Makes you invisible. Oh, hello. Hello, my mother. Mm, this is fine. Nice. Although I got like no gold for that, which is kind of a shame. So, uh, which boots? I think generally you want to go for the reverse, right? Yeah. Because reverse just has uh, an actual high level item there. <clears throat> I'm switching to Angel Arena now. I mean, like. I like it. I don't know. Are you guys not having a good time? This is kind of cool, isn't it? I need way more mana. Why are you just letting me kill you? <laughs> Alright, I'm just kind of running around wrecking shit. I mean, that works for me. When can you buy a shard? I also need more mana. How do you buy an Aghanim's shard in this? Restore. Oh! You you can buy it now, apparently. Look at that. Nine minutes, I guess. 
Well, that's kind of neat. Oh, this is 6,300 gold. I do not have enough money for that. Well, I guess I guess we're not getting a shard. At least not yet. Let's get some mana first. What's a good tool for mana? Life catcher. Doesn't this do like damage? All right, let's get this. Let's get a life catcher. Oh crap! These creeps are way too strong for me. Oh my god, these creeps are way too strong for me. Okay, never mind. So what does this do? Um, gives mana region. Uh, projectile applies damage plus 200% damage from main attribute. Damage from main attribute will heal caster. Well, I kind of want base damage anyway, right? That's kind of why I picked Omni Knight, because I want to use the shard. Helm of the Dominator, crazy Helm of the Dominator. Okay, they are just RGB ghosts. You know what? They are RGB ghosts, and I really appreciate that. <laughs> That's a great description for them. <laughs> okay. So we have a lot a lot of mana now, which is very good. I feel very nice about that. It's one of those things where I think with our Omni Knight right now, more mana, that's just better. Right? The more mana we have, the happier we are. Oh, hello. No, I got healing. Don't worry. Oh, come here. Yeah. Nice. No big deal. Why do you go invisible? <laughs> Stop it. Alright, got it. <laughs> Very good. Oh yeah, there's like a much wider variety of creeps now. Oh, hello. No. Y'all yeah, shoot this. Yeah, you're just gonna leave, right? Okay. That's fine. I'm happy to just kind of like brawl it out over here. Uh, I got healing. Hmm. I guess not enough healing, though. No! No! Let me go! Very good. I remember how 300,000 years ago with Omni Knight, this ability just took three days to come out. And it was just the worst thing because people would just constantly run away from you and you could never ever catch them. And it sucked. Alright. So, we're gonna just like... Run in there, right? Like, I mean, I'm, I'm hella strong. I kind of want to get value out of my ultimate. Yep. We got pretty good value out of our ultimate, I think. Healing. Can I use this on you? No, I can only use it on enemies. Ooh, healing. Ooh, run, run, run. Oh, that disarm. Oh, I'm done. I'm done. Damn. Juggernaut. So, uh, we sell this. We probably don't need that. Um, what should we get? What do we feel? What do we feel is good? Uh, we probably need this uh, battle fury, demons fury stuff, don't we? Oh, it's enchanted skull, corrupted skull, devil's helm, burning blades. Damn, that's a hmm. Does heart build into anything fun? Builds it. Oh, 140 strength. Oh, we're getting this bad boy. Oh, yes. we're getting this. It's not even that expensive. Like, that's actually just really... <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> like, you don't even do enough damage to aggro the guy. And once you do, you will die. <laughs> I like how the Dazzle doesn't see the fact that that wolf doesn't even see... Doesn't even see him as, like, enough of a threat to attack... As just kind of like, <laughs> as like a, a sign that maybe this is not, not the time for it yet, you know? Maybe it's a bit early. Okay, get this. Yeah, we're just gonna, I'm gonna get this hard, dude. Like, hell yeah. That's so much stats, it's crazy. Well, I'm gonna upgrade this, I think. I'm not entirely sure how to upgrade things, but. Where, how, where does this go? Ah, this kind of leads around like this, okay. Gotta figure out these uh, these patterns. 
What's that? Oh, it's just a creep count. So where's the bosses? Is the bosses just kind of like chilling? I don't know why I'm always on their side of the map, by the way. It's just like, I don't know, it's my home, dude. That's where I like being. <clears throat> Very good. Uh, nothing here. Ooh. Yeah. yeah I, don't, I don't like that. Okay. What? Bane! That was... That was a lot of damage, dude. Oh, whew. I don't know what I'm gonna do about that Bane, honestly. <laughs> that is scary. Bane and Sky stuff, dude. Felt like it, for sure. For sure, my guy. That's the scariest Sky stuff I've ever seen. Uh, sky Staff is already pretty scary. I don't think you need to further quantify it as a scary Sky Staff, right? <clears throat> Alright, there we go. Bull whip. Is this good? Gives movement speed. I don't care about that. But maybe I can sell it. I should also use this right here. <sighs> Still just working on my heart. I also need 6,300 gold just for the Aghanim shard. Like, I really want this shard. It's just so expensive. Legendary holo rarity ghosts. <laughs> Ghost sky stuff. <laughs> yeah, dude. Alright, these, these item drops, they're all worth nothing. Oh, I should get... Oh, this is what I forgot, right? Hand of Midas. Yeah. Should probably get that first. Instead of, like, getting the big heart. Because that'll provide us with a lot of money. I think that's gonna be the better way to go. Because I was just kind of, like, wondering... I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm farming too much. Like, I, I'm playing more of this, like, aggressing... Here, all right, I'm, I'm on their side and I'm trying to, like, do damage and such. And that is a very legitimate strategy, right? Like, that's absolutely, absolutely something you can and probably should be doing. But, that's very important, but there. Um, you know, it doesn't mean that you're probably not going to be making that much money. Okay. Ooh. Nice. Wow, that's a big force stuff right there. That like just yeeted me out of there. <laughs> okay. All right, put this over here. Just give me a creep. Can I hand off minus these, please? No. No, they're still ancients. Okay. I was kind of really hoping we'll be able to do that, but I suppose not. So this seems like it doesn't even heal that much. 8 health per charge. So 8 times 25, that's 200. Uh, I guess it does seem like it heals that much. Ow. Stop it. Luckily, we can take those hits. Got hard. Dude, that's a problem. I don't have any sort of stun. Nice. You know what the best stun is? Killing the nerd. Alright, lightnings, lightnings, lightnings. Alright, run, 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 run. Hey, look at us. We actually won. Sick. Now I actually feel kind of happy I didn't use my Hand of Midas, because now I can use the better Hand of Midas. <laughs> the best stun? Yeah, dude. This, look, this is absolutely a thing. The best stun in the game is just killing your opponent. 100%. Please na name, name a stun that is better than killing your opponent. I just didn't didn't think so. Didn't think you could. <clears throat> Ironwood tree. Plus 10 all attributes. I think I keep my Pullman shield. The 30 damage block is really nice. <clears throat> Winning the game. Oh, damn, dude. You figured it out, actually. That one is better than, than killing your opponent. 
just like driving over to their place and, <laughs> and unplugging their computer. <laughs> That's the best stunt. They'll never see it coming. Just stealing their internet. Plugging the electricity, uh, like unplugging the electricity to their house. All right. I think after I get this heart, I'm actually gonna save up for my for my shard. I mean, like, yeah, it's quite a lot of money away, but I think it's it's just quite it is it is it's just about strong enough to be worth it. Oh, thanks, I guess. <laughs> Oh, that is so mean. <laughs> that is so mean. Okay. Dating them and making them stop playing Dota Dam. That's a that's a hardcore stun. That feels <laughs> that doesn't that feels kind of like immoral as well, I have to say. <laughs> Oh my god, that Aquila, what the fuck? 60 damage. Alright, chill. I mean, I'll take it, but I that is an intense Aquila right there. Alright, take down these creeps. Uh, still working on this heart. These creeps are starting to actually get a bit strong, which... Makes things a bit tricky. That's okay, I guess. Never sure. Twenty percent magic resistance and twenty percent spell damage, and it doesn't actually have a downside. Does anybody want this never sure? Yeah, might be good on you, I don't know. I don't really think I need it. Alright, I'm big. Oh, hell, you look at my health region. <clears throat> and what's the actual goal of this uh, game mode? Uh, getting 100 kills. So you can see at the top, there's a, there's a 100 there. And we need to get 100 kills before the opponents do. Hell yeah, can I handle minus this? No. I mean, obviously not. <laughs> I really didn't have any hopes for that. <laughs> But it would have been sick. Imagine that. Uh, get this. Okay. We'll get Dejanor. Craggy code. Minus 100 attack speed and 150 health. Well, that seems terrible. And 13 armor. Quicksilver amulet. 10 movement speed. Nah. Seems kind of garbage. Uh, all right, can we just chill? I propose, I propose the following: I just TP and you leave me alone. All right, thank you very much. All I want is I want to save up six thousand three hundred gold to get this Aghanim shard, and then I have hopefully a really, really powerful ability, and that's it. Why does Shadowfiend look like asphyxiating Mishwanda? Um, it's actually a good question. Especially considering I think this... Isn't this skin really new? And asphyxiating... We have had asphyxiating Mishwanda for a long time. I think Valve might be... Might be taking some inspiration. No, of course they're not. <laughs> Alright, coming in here. I am ready. Let's do this. I have this, which gives something. Here you go. Oh, you want it? Who wants it? I really think we should be like sticking together so my guardian angel actually hits you, you know? Because like guardian angel has a really big radius. Like it's actually kind of massive, but still. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Yes. Shadow Fiend. Guardian Angel can't do it. I'm silence. Got him. Double kill. Easy life. Look at how strong I am. Just nailing it. Absolutely no problem. 
Arcane Blink going hard, though, for sure. All right, we have Hammer of Purity. 1.5 seconds cooldown. It does 700 damage. Let's go, dude. Holy hell, they buffed it. And how they buffed it. Whoo. Whoo. Look at it go, dude. That's the good shit. That's what I wanted. What about like Octarine or something like that? Is Octarine even in this mode? Sealed Rune, Mystical Sword. Sword. Yeah, if every attack on us, 20% chance to play a Maim. Ooh, who cares? Bandolin's Blade. Mosaius Blade. Immediately restore 75 health per charge. Dark Edge. Oh, I need that for that. Oh, I guess I might as well get this because I'm going for a Dark Edge. It's 80 in total attributes. I want stats. I'm all about stats, dude, for sure. Alright, we're gonna purify the shit out of anyone that gets near us. I mean, this ability is actually so sick. Can't you buy stats in this mod? Can't I just buy strength? <laughs> Maybe that's actually a viable strategy here. I don't know, we'll see. I need creeps to Hand of Midas. Oh, you buy this now, the Blessed Essence. Okay. They've really changed a lot there. Just like lots of small details are changed. Which I always find really... Oh my god. 50% base attack damage. Oh, it doesn't work. Oh, no, it doesn't just... But it just doesn't add as base attack. Okay, that's a shame. But it's still nice. 30% magic resistance, 30% status resistance. That's the good stuff. What's you? Shrine. Hmm. I miss shrines. Chad, push one if you miss shrines. I... I liked shrines. I think they were really cool. Ha! Yeah, sure, like, fuck it, fiend script me, dude. I've got, like, no cooldown. Oh, my God. <laughs> yeah, bring it, nerd. <laughs> Who's next? <laughs> Alright, Omni Knight feels really good. Just really kind of a good hero, no? What do we do with this? We need the Soul Stone Soul Collector. Mm, it's 35 strength, I guess. Is this worth going for? It's a lot of money. We need a boss soul. Hey, you guys want to try killing a boss? Like, I think bosses, like, drop new stuff. Like, you see these boss souls and shit? Yes, Where are the bosses? Is Enchantress still here? No, it's not there anymore. Where are the bosses? Where even are they? Ooh. This is... Is this the only boss? No, that can't... Uh, yeah, we can easily kill this now, though. I got it. Don't worry about it. Boss soul. Enigmatic fire. Satan's sword shard. I got my boss soul. I'm happy. You guys can share the rest of this stuff. Um, so for this, I just need a boss soul, right? An ambush knife and dark edge recipe. And there it is. Hell yeah, dark edge. Nice. Now that's some power. Third eye. Ah, that feels like somebody should have it, right? That feels like somebody should carry that. And it might as well be the tanky boy. Alright, we're gonna go down here and see what this is about. This looks like a boss to me. And if so, well, let's see if we can maybe take this on. Oh my god, these bosses really, like, they, they, they got made fancy. Okay. 
We activate this and then just yeet ourselves in there, right? Oh my god, that is so gross. Whoo! Got it. Where's the puck? Wait, where did the boss go? Wasn't there a boss here? <laughs> Hello! <laughs> there you are. Wait, no, you're just another creep camp. Pretty strong creep camp, but still just another creep camp. Oh, where are the bosses then? Is it just the one guy there? Just these in the in the center. And I guess Doom. No, I checked that. That's not a boss. It's just a creep cam. I just killed it. I gave you 15 on gold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, I'm not saying that it's not worth killing. It's obviously worth killing. But there's a big difference between something that's worth killing and a boss. Alright. Alright, we've got... We've got some money. Um, we have to kind of figure out what we want to do with that money. Like, what items are we going for? Yes. We can maybe go for this. We do need a boss soul again. Angel sword is just in the store. Okay. So there is another boss. The beast warrior. Oh, you killed it. Boss soul. You guys gotta actually pick that shit up, you know? I guess I do just kind of go for this life catcher thing. It doesn't seem like the worst. What happens? How strong are you? Well, it seems like the boss has also kind of got nerfed a lot. Although this guy still goes hard. Never mind. Okay, now this guy still goes hard. <laughs> uh, we'll get this and this and this. And so now we have the soul collector. Which, I don't know how good that is for us, but, I mean, it, it does give 35% spell damage, which does mean uh, our Helm of Purity will be amplified. Hero changing boss. Yeah, maybe something is here in this area? Oh, this guy's back. I guess we just take this guy down whenever we can, right? Whew. Putting up a fight, but not too much. Nothing we can't handle. Okay, Enigmatic Fire, Joe Black's Kato Shard. Hmm. That uh, doesn't seem super useful. <laughs> well, at least I don't really know what to do with it. Is Fear Boss is better or worse? Um, I think it's... My initial impression is that I don't like it as much. Because I feel like that's a big part of Angel Arena. If you take away the bosses, you know, like, then what are you really left with? Um, I don't know. Like, that's maybe a bit rough, right? Like, that's maybe going a bit too far. But I do feel like the bosses are a really important aspect that you shouldn't, like, just toss aside. M -m 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 Monster kill. Can I attack this? Oh, I can. And I do a lot of damage to it. Okay. Yeah, sure, we can fight. Hey. No, just come on. Alright, very good. Hello. <laughs> I got it, don't worry. <laughs> Only night strikes me as pretty good. <laughs> I probably do want to get some better items. So this is like an AoE effect now, which is kind of neat. <clears throat> Rude. <laughs> How dare you? Here, let me let me let me show you what happens to wieners like you. Hmm. I guess maybe that guy's going a bit far. No! Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's maybe on me. So this is good. Um, 
this right here is not really that useful anymore. We can just replace that. It's more of a question of what we replace it with, though. Right? Like, what do we actually want to buy instead? And that I'm not too sure about. Burning Blades. I mean, honestly, I think we should get a Demon's Fury. Just because it's, it's, it's just a good way to actually use all of your money. Because it's so expensive. And it, 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 well, it's not necessarily what we need. Right? It's like, if I were to make a list of items that fulfill our exact needs, this would not make it. But we don't really need something that's exactly what we need. As long as it's just enough. Right? And it is very much enough. Very good. So we can eat this and we get these damned swords. Very good. Red blink? Mm, we could, I guess. I don't know. Do we need it? I feel like our mobility is already looking really nice. Hmm. Have we checked this area yet? I want to see if maybe there's a boss there. This is what I'm uh, mostly kind of like interested in. They can't have just removed. Oh yeah, see, there's another one. There is a boss here. Very good. Okay. <laughs> Chill, dude. <laughs> boss goes hard. <clears throat> Do you find Octarine in the shop? No, I have not found. I uh, maybe if we like. Search for it? No. Like, it, they didn't have Octarine even before the patch. So, I don't know. I guess they might have added it in, but I suppose they didn't, so. Okay, nothing here. Just kind of looking for... Just kind of looking for another boss, Titan Slivers. Yeah, I have this third eye, um, which I think it's probably good for somebody to have it, although I don't really feel super happy about having it, because obviously it doesn't give me much in terms of stats. And something like, uh, whatever it's called, would definitely be way better. How are you doing? Oh. Hmm, I don't do enough damage on my own. I mean, I'm pretty strong, but I don't do that much damage. Because you just need to... You just need, you really need to go very hard there. Wow, this boss is healing a lot. They're having a hard time with this. Thanks for the boss, though. <laughs> uh, this gives a bunch of stats. Do you want this over just a bunch of damage? Probably, actually. It's also actually percentage-based movement speed. Which is kind of crazy. Alright, nice. We have a Demon's Fury. Oh man, we are really scary strong. You sneak a little bastard if you have 3.5 e powers and you lose all your powers. I, I, that's okay. I was never, I was never much of a paladin player in the first place. I am a sorcerer. If I play D and D, I like, I like like sorcerers and druids, weird people. They can, they are just kind of like do weird stuff. My current D&D &D character in the campaign I'm playing with my friends is a sorcerer that only knows fire spells and illusions. That's my two things. And the only illusions that I use are illusions that set things on fire. <laughs> Alright. I don't know how these guys work, honestly. Okay, uh, we got another boss, so... 
What do we do with this? We can get... Does this give much stats? 17. Into all attributes, not really. Spiked armor? Reaper's mask. Foodie into all stats. Wait, wasn't there a thing like uh, the build out of this? No, I guess they removed that. Hello. Hey! Trying to chase you down. Oh, hello. How are you guys doing? <laughs> well, I didn't mean to interrupt. Sorry. Uh. Oh my god. That is so gross. Shadow Fiend is just like way the fuck OP. How do you even fight that? Like that that new blink dagger. That new blink dagger is really nasty. Trickster cloak. I haven't really used the detection yet. But that's always the thing about detection, right? Like you run around with a with a with a gem. And then you're like, huh. Weird. Now that I have the gem, nobody is invisible. And it's like, well, bitch, you know, <laughs> if you didn't have the gem, then maybe they would. Oh, there's a spell prism, though. Now this is worth considering. All right, I guess somebody else will have to use this. Just let me go. Do you really want to fight me? Is this really your goal here? <laughs> Because I will fight you, I don't mind. <laughs> that's just, that's just, there's, there's some, there's some real energy that comes along with it. I kind of appreciate, I kind of appreciate the confidence of that. But at the same time, are you insane? Like, what did you expect was going to happen? So I need to figure out what to do with this boss soul. Void Scepter. 60 and I already need that. Spiked Armor. Uh, what else? Lightning Flash. Or Reaper's Mask. I think a Reaper's Mask is probably best. That seems the most useful to my team. And also gives plus 30 into all stats, which is nice. Void Scepter has cooldown reduction. Oh, does it? Oh, I didn't see that. Void Scepter. What are we looking at here? 25% cooldown reduction. Oh, okay. Well, that... Hmm. But do we need, like, I don't know, the cooldown reduction, like, I feel like we're not gonna get that much value out of it. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Let me out. Let me out. I am so sorry. This is just not fair. <laughs> I think removing the bosses so much, like, did they remove too many of them? I feel like here in the corner, they, you can put some bosses here. You can put some bosses here. Right now, it seems there's five bosses on the map. And I just don't think that's enough. Because it just really makes it so that it matters so much more that you, like... You know, you get ahead and then you zone them out of boss souls and what are they gonna do about it? <clears throat> so that's maybe something where they need to consider it. You stole the item. Yeah, I know, I know. And on top of that, you only get one boss soul per boss. Right? So there's like less bosses and less items per boss. 
since it seems you can only use I mean what do I do with this 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 uh Joe Black's Katar shard you can't build anything with it it's just like a consumable thing or something it's just an item right and it's not even that good so since the only thing you need from bosses is the boss soul reducing the amount of bosses you've effectively reduced the amount of items they drop it makes it so that getting ahead and being able to kill them is becoming way more important oh you got it fawn good job Fucking nailed it. <laughs> Who's Joe? Um, there's a hero in this game all called Joe Gun... Gunjo. Gunjo. That's his name. Not Joe Gun. Although that's kind of a fun name too. It's like a custom hero. Honestly speaking, I don't find Gunjo to be all that interesting of a hero. But I guess he exists. Alright, everybody's got BKB and I don't like it. Stop it! Alright, I'm ready. Hello. <laughs> it seems to me like Omni Knight is about as good as I had hoped he would be. I, he just seems crazy powerful. Also, this right here, the Soul Collector, actually, surprisingly, a very strong item. I just want to kill Fawn. <laughs> I should probably leave the fountain. No, they got me! <laughs> Alright, aren't there tomes? I think there's tomes. Yes! Alright. Oh, I can't buy back. Oh, I'm out of tomes of strength. Okay. Great. Got it. I should actually just buy Tome of uh, Heroes. Because they are... They are actually more... But there's a max level of 100, right? So. It's fine. Alright, cool. Alright, we're strong. Yeah! Hell yeah, we're so strong. Call the dude in the middle. <laughs> like that? <laughs> I do so much more damage. <laughs> hey, come. No! Alright, don't worry. Oh, no! Oh. Alright, just let me. Just let me. Oh, God. Just. Got it. Okay, we did the Queen of Pango. We strong, we bonk. Oh yeah, we bonk. Let me bonk this guy. <laughs> Shadow Fiend goes hard too. Alright, come on. Get it over. We need two more kills. Why are you pushing me out? Get back here! Oh. I guess I'm just gonna have to kill Fawn again. <laughs> no, I wanna kill Fawn! Don't kill him! I wanna kill him! Oh. Alright. Oh, they added a final duel! Alright, well, that's looking a little suspicious. No, 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 no. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna believe that you. That, that's just. Uh, no, no. I, 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 I. You, you, you added my final duel. I like it. I'm happy. Final duel is fucking banging. All right. It seems that it's just gonna be the next duel, though. All 
Um, yeah, I don't know how it's gonna work with the final duel. The final duel is probably gonna be like the next duel. Instead of like being an immediate duel like we had it. Okay. I thought, okay, is this is this me just being arrogant? But like, I thought that the way the map was designed and like of the, like a few of the things that are in here and the way like some of the creeps were done and all of that reminds me a bit of OAA, right? It reminds me quite a bit of it. And the final duel, I mean, that's just kind of well, that seems fairly straightforward. I mean, like. But I don't know. Alright, max level. Let's go. <clears throat> and I don't mind. Please don't take this as me being upset or anything like that. I think it's cool. I really like it. You know, in a way I can look at this as like, hey, you know, somebody took the ideas and the thoughts that I put into, into making our Angel Arena and, you know, got some use out of them. Which is great. That's amazing. I'm really happy about that. Um... But it's also just kind of interesting to me whether or not that's actually a thing or if I'm just being an arrogant ass. No I don't know. Wait, Fawn. Fawn left! <laughs> what are we <laughs> Come on, dude. It was one more duel! One more duel! You might as well stick it out. Oh my god, what the fuck, we're getting fucked up, dude. Nah, we got him. Yeah! Victory for the bless of gods, that's right. For the bless of god. Alright then. That was actually quite a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it too. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating on the video. I definitely appreciate that. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Goodbye.